Hello guys, well, my name is Erica and today I'll be showing you how to make your own custom weapons with animations in Roblox using RCM. Let's get into it. If you haven't already, then uh, you should install uh, RCM. It's a modification of ACS, Advanced Combat System, I believe. That's what it's called. But I have a short doing that in less than 60 seconds. It's really easy. So, if you want to create your own guns using it, then this is this is what I'm going to show you. So, first of all, you will need a model. So, for this model, I will be using for this tutorial. I'll be using this by Woolboy or Woolboy, I believe. And if we go to the Explorer, you can see the model here. Put that into workspace. So, uh, a requirement for this model is that the model cannot be one singular mesh. The mesh, it has to have a mag, uh, a box, and a slide part. So, the slide looks like this, and it's what the bullets will come out of. I'm also uh, selecting this by using Alt and then clicking because this is a model. So the mag, you should know what a mag looks like. That's the mag, and the bolt is this. So after you have that, you want to go to replicate the storage, ACS engine, and then grab any gun model. I will use the M4, car M4 carbine for this. Just uh, Control D to duplicate it, Control X, and then Control V. That will put it into our uh, workspace. And then we can just close off the replicated storage. If we go into the Envoy Carbine, we can see it has a handle, it has an aim part, and all these other sight marks, aim part twos, bolts. Basically, what we really need, core, like the core components we need, is the aim part and the handle. So if we control X and then control shift V to paste into, we can see the handle and the aim part as part of this model. So you can see that right here. So this is going to be our handle. So like what I like to do is I like to get the sight, so the or like the lens, uh, copy the position, going into transform in our properties go into the handle and then paste that. It will put the position of the uh, uh, the sight, the lens, so I just like to, because that just centers it. So then I, I like to put the handle by the grip because that's where the, that's where the uh, hand will go. And then the aim part, uh, if you put that, copy that position and then push it a little bit back. Boom. And now we need to rename these parts, like the bolt. So we need to rename it to bolt. Uh, this one to slide. And then this one to mag. Only mag. Although it's already named that. So we don't have to do that. Oops. So now, what we have to do is for this, you might have seen that the bolt has some parts to it, and it's the audio. So if we just copy, or like cut, and then place it into our bolt, I'll just go through here, Control shift v puts that into there. So now, what else we have to do is we have to set our muzzle component. So our muzzle component is already centered, we just need to put it like we just need to like put it where the muzzle is. And then the chamber needs to go where the slide is. Just also here. Then boom, that's your gun already done. It doesn't take long at all. So if we just put that into 
left click here to storage and enter gun models. If you press F2 to rename, but we're not going to rename anything. If you press Ctrl C, then that will uh, copy it. That will copy the name at least. Yeah, that copies the name. Then if you go into starter pack and then the M4 carbine, if we control, uh, if we duplicate it using Control B, and then rename it to the copied name. You can like later rename this to whatever you want. So let's say just click gun two and we'll copy it, and then paste it. And once we hit play, which is F5, or just hit the play button, you'll see that our gun has been holstered here, and it shows up. You can see it there. The scope does not work, but I will show you how to do that in a later episode. Yeah, but I'll also show you how to configure that in a later episode as well. I uh, hope you enjoyed, hope this helped you, but yeah, thanks for watching.